Okay, guys, so today we're going to be doing another exposing video. Today we're going to be exposing Shadical. Okay, now, have you probably seen Shadical, right, guys? So, basically, if you, if you don't know Shadical, he's basically um, a YouTuber that um, is that he is a member of Team Porknife. Now, if you don't know what Team Porknife is, is basically um, a team where Mr. Top 5 would, Mr. Top 5 created it. Yep, Mr. Top 5 created the Team Porknife, and then, like, he, um, like, invited his friends to join it. And guess what? Shackle is actually one of Mr. Top 5's friends. Yep, he's actually one of Mr. Top 5's friends, and, like, and like yeah, so we see Shackle is friends with the worst YouTuber I I've ever seen. Like he's friends with Mr. Top Five. Like he's literally friends with one of the worst YouTubers ever. Like like and after watching all of his videos, like I could see why um Shackle and Mr. Top Fives are one of the one of the, the best friendships have one of the best friendships I've ever seen. It's because um they literally clickbait children like they literally trick children like that's like that's literally their job like their jobs are to trick children also did a poll by the way so um yeah so make sure you want so make sure you follow me on Twitter so that way you will never miss these polls and basically most of you chose shackle so yeah okay now if you take a look at one of his videos if you take a look at some of his videos they're literally all 10 minutes and literally just like a couple of seconds long. So I'm, I'm guessing this is the one reason why why everybody hates him is because like he stretches most of his videos are over are on 10 on the 10 minute mark. So basically what so if you so guys if you didn't know if you stretch your videos to 10 minutes you can get a whole bunch of money from it and you can get you can literally get get a lot of money if you stretch your videos to 10 minutes. <laughs> But also, the one problem I have with him is that um that um he uses mislead tags. So, if if, if so, if you're wondering, well, like, well, qua, like, what are you talking about? What what do tags do? Well, what do what tags do is that they basically um they help you ha rank higher in the search results, and they um help you rank your video higher. So that way, you know, if you put tags on your videos, um, then it they will help you rank higher into the search results, and you know they will. I'll help your video get get reach out on, on YouTube more, so that way you, you can get more subscribers and more views and more likes and all of that stuff. So, what I decided to do is that I decided to look at Shackle's tags, and on this video right here that you're about to see, you're you're going to see it says new chapter season two battle pass tier 100 in Fortnite, 100 percent unlocked. Now, um, I looked at this video's tags and. Okay, now, um, here are the, the video tags for the video, and as you can see, so here's what the tag says, New Chapter 2, Battle Pass Unlocked. Now, let's look at the tags. Now, if you see the tags, um, there's one problem to this one, and if you look at the bottom, uh, uh the, the last four, um, tags that are in the, are there in the video, it says Lachlan, Lachlan Battle Pass, Battle Pass views are epic, Laser Beam, like, like those tags, they literally have nothing to do with the video. Okay, now as you can see, um, if you look at YouTube terms of services, they clearly say, "Don't use misleading and met metadata or thumbnails." Using the title is, and uh, you can read this if you want, but the YouTube terms of services, they clearly say that you are not allowed to use misleading thumbnails and misleading tags. So yeah, so it is so what he's doing on his tags of the videos. So he's tagging things that aren't related to the video, and that is against YouTube's terms of services. So now let's take a look at one of his videos. Okay, so so let's check out his newest videos. Okay, so his newest videos. This video is titled "I Snuck Into a Girls Only Fashion Show in Fortnite." Like, oh, I, I doubt that this is real. I, I I doubt it. Anyway, guys, let's check out this video and see how, how um horrible this video is. By the way, if you want to join and talk to me, I found these ladies that were literally talking about a girls only fashion show. Now, I don't know what's going on. Basically, what he's talking about is that um, some ladies were talking on his Discord server. And, um, he, and he heard that they were having a secret girls fashion show. A, a girls only fashion show. Like... Like, that's kind of creepy if you think about it. Like, like, like imagine, like... 
like, imagine if you're a girl and, like, you're just trying to have, uh, like, a secret, like, girls-only fashion show um, with your friends and stuff. And then, like, Shackle, this guy right here, like, he's listening on, he's listening in your chat. Like, that'll be kind of creepy, right? Like, that's a little bit creepy, to be honest. Don't worry, guys. Um, yeah, like, don't don't believe in that. Yeah, like, he, he he's just doing that just so, like, you, you can, you can, um... Use the support career code. It's one catch. It's, it's girls only. Wait, it's what? Girls only. What do you mean girls only? Read it. Wait, it's okay. girls only. Only, you know. Only. Like, only, you know. It says no boys allowed. What? <laughs> so I can't join. Like, get, what if I just like walk in? Like, am I? Um, duh. Why do you think it says girls only? Like, are you stupid? Wow. And I bet you, like, Shackle, he told the girls to act like that. He told them to act like that. Like, I don't, I never seen a girl say, oh, like, you can't join our girls only club. Like, that kind of sounds like what a kid girl would do. Like, that sounds like a, um, uh, like a little girl would say. Like, these are like, and remember, the girls that are playing with him, these are like, kind of like grown women. So, like, I do not see a grown woman talking like that. Good. Like, I'll, you know, I have my visitor skin. I'll do like an emo for you. Like, I'll do a little bit of this. I'll do a little bit of that. Like, come on, please. We can't, we can't trust. Oh, boy, stop trying. Like, like, it's a girls only club. Just, just, just leave them alone. Like, you're kind of stalking them right now when you said it in the beginning of the video. A girls only fashion show in, like, this was based on my Discord, dude. I have no, literally no idea what they're. Wait a second. Why aren't the girls going into the fashion show? Like, you would think that they would go into the fashion show map already. Like, what are they doing? Okay, so what should I call the account then? Because I have the name right now and I can change it. So what should I change it to? Okay, I think Emma Oliver 25. Okay, so I'm guessing like- Wait a second. Why does the girl sound like one of the members of the girls only going club, fashion show club? Like, what? Wait, wait, let, let's compare their voices. Like, yeah, we'll just what, join what another server. You're not allowed. Are you all over 25? Okay, so I'm guessing like your little sister. Oh, they kind of sound a little bit similar, huh? 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 Man. Wow. The, the, this is really real. Okay, so the rest of the video, basically, in and later in the video, so basically, um, um, the girl, like the girls, are convinced that she, I um, mean, that he's a girl, and you know, I think like the girl just like introduces them to them to him, and you know, and let's see how this video is gonna go, cause you know, let's see if the video can you know cannot get any worse. It's crazy. Look at this. Uh, this is our girls' only fashion what? show building. This um, why do they not expect that, um, it's Shadical? Like, he's wearing a girl visitor skin. Like, how do they not know that it's him? So, uh, in the middle of the video, he, 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 um, like, says, oh, like, like the video if you're ready. Like, I hate it when, when somebody asks you to like the video in the middle of the video. Like, don't ask for likes until the end of the video. Like, like, oh my god. Like, if you put it in the middle of the video, then it makes you look scummy. Who runs the world? Wait, what? Wait, what kind of question is that? So basically, so you're saying a woman uh, owns the world because of a song? Or something like that? Like, cause they said something like that in the video. Like, that's kind of weird. Uh, so they got- Wait, do they want me to like, pick up the sword? It's like glow- Yeah, it says- Claim the infinity blade, but like, no, this has to have like a girl like twist on it though. Like, I'm trying to think like, like if I pick it up, like, are they gonna be like, no, because like, okay, I I'm gonna pick it up because like I'm worthy. I don't. Oh my God, bro, you're supposed to look around. Are you that stupid? Oh my God. So and then later they found out that it was him, but they're cool with it. I mean, they're nice girls, but like, this video was so fake. Okay, guys, now, that video was horrible. That was really horrible. Oh, my God. That was that was so hard to watch. Also, I just want to mention that Shackle has a second channel called Badical, and it's basically like a reaction channel. So, I went to, to the video, and um, I'm guessing that this is kind of like the start of the clip. Okay, so that was the start of the clip. Okay, does 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 it does does it show up in the start of the clip? 
Wait a second. It's not even in the video. Wait a second. So he's linking in the description. He's linking videos that aren't even his, and like just so, and it's not even in the video, just so that he can get more relevancy in the search results. Like, oh my god, this guy's really a scumbag. Oh my gosh, guys, like, you have to see this video. This video was called, I Tried Stopping the Monster in Fortnite. Like, why? Bro, you can't stop an event no matter what you do. Like, oh my god, bro. This, like, th this is literally the same thing that Mr. Top 5 did. Like, oh my god. Like, I'm actually starting to wonder, like, is he trying to be, like, Mr. Top 5 or something like that? Anyway, guys, let's just check out this horrible video. And I am completely building over the robot in hopes that we could possibly alter the Fortnite universe, alter the future of Fortnite forever. I don't know if this is possible. Shadow Kill and I. So basically, what they're doing in this video is that they're basically um, going to try and stop the event by building uh, like, above the Mega Team Leader. Like, you can't stop an event. Like,. Oh my god, dude, this is so bad. Because it has a jetpack. We, no, dude, we covered the top. It. We definitely covered the top. Look what I'm doing right now. Do you see me in game right now? I okay, am at the I storm and I am placing so many, so much wood, dude. Literally. Bro, like, you can't stop the mech, bro. Like, you can't do anything to it. Like, it's not gonna stop it. Are you guys stupid or what? So let's see if they actually stop the event. What is going Holy. on? Ah, it's oh terrifying! Gosh. Oh my- Wait, how- <laughs> Wow, he said that it was scary. That That's funny. A freaking 18-year-old man is scared of, uh, of a monster that is in a kid's game. <laughs> wow, it's so funny. Oh my gosh, the block! The block! I'm gonna I'm stop it shaking. myself! Take him down. Dude, you're so cringy, and you're you're literally acting so stupid. You sound stupid right now. You can't stop the monster. Like, like you're just gonna teleport. Like, you're just gonna, like gonna like go through him and just teleport out of there, his body. Like, you can't do anything to it. Also, guys, sorry for that uh, silence right there. <laughs> anyway, let's continue to the video. Oh my gosh, oh my wait a minute, gosh. look! No, no way, no way. Wow, would you look at that, it didn't stop him, wow, yeah, what did you expect? So the rest of the video is just them reacting to the event, it's just, oh my god, like, it's so horrible. He's, like, I like how the title says, I tried stopping the monster, but he didn't stop it, like, <laughs> he, he, he didn't stop it. And guess what, guys? He did the same thing to the Star Wars event. Like, you want proof? Here it is. Right right here. So this this video is, is titled, I ruined the Star Wars event in Fortnite. Like, how did you, like, you can't stop an event. How can you ruin, how did you even ruin the event? It is about to happen, and I am going to be watching the entire thing from Fort Tori's perspective. If you guys don't know who Fort Tori is, make sure to leave a like and go subscribe. Wait a second. He says he's watching a, a live stream. Like, what? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. And literally, Mr. Top 5 did the same thing on on his Star Wars event video as well. Like, wow. It's like this guy actually wants to be Mr. Top 5. Okay, guys. Um, I found a video that is so horrible. Okay, like, literally, this video has to be the worst video on his channel. And we could definitely see it in, in the title and the thumbnail. And also, guess what, guys? Um, Shackle used to be one of those live stream channels where you know they will act like something's happened, but like it it doesn't. So it looks like he hasn't deleted those videos. So yeah, he's clearly a bad YouTuber. The title is called "Epic Games Bought Me a House for Night." Okay, so why would Epic Games buy this guy and this guy only a house? Like, Epic Games, like, they, they do not do that. They're a company. Why would a company do that for you? Anyway, guys, we're, we're going to check out this video and see how horrible this video is. Now, all right, so I got a very... Wow, this video already sounds dumb. Like, oh my gosh. This is Epic Games, Andy, 
and he invited me, he sent me an email saying that he apparently works for Epic Games and that Epic Games wants to give me a brand new house. Wow, this is literally so funny to me because, like, I bet you Epic Games Andy is one of his friends. Like, he, like, Shackle told him to, told him to not talk in the mic and, you know, and he decided, you know, that to act, to act like a freaking Epic Games employee. Like, he told him to act like an Epic Games employee. Like, wow, that's so funny. The house and he destroyed the sign. I guess he's in a bad mood. I hope I didn't actually upset him, but all right. So it looks like we got ourselves some parkour here. Do you want me to stay here or do you want me to, or are you going to follow me up to the parkour? Why would Epic Games make you do a parkour for a house? Like... Why couldn't- why couldn't they just, like, buy you the house, like, straight away? No way this is real, because if Epic Games, like, why would they buy me a house? There's no way they would, but here we go in three- How funny that you asked that, because, you know, because- because probably this is a fake video. Basically, the Epic Games employee, he shows him his house, and, like, you know, he shows him, like, a layout of what his house is going to be like, because, you know, this is in Fortnite, and, like, this is what it would look like in real life, apparently. So I'm breaking this. Wait, what? Your new address will be mailed to you. Further information will be in the will be in the email. What? This is what I don't get. Why would Epic Games make him go to a parkour map and then they will send the email to him? Like what? That makes no sense. Now, guys, now so basically, um, you know, I don't want to bore you with you know, all the gameplay that he's talking about right here. So let's now let's uh, skip to the part where he gives us a tour of his real house. So it wasn't even that big of a move. I'm actually living in the house right now. I think the house right now, there doesn't seem to be any problems at all. Everything seems to be pretty. Wait a second. Like, if you're in the house already, then why you say buy? The, why you say like Epic Games bought you a house? And also, I like it how he says he doesn't know why Epic Games like um freaking bought him a house, but but like the sign says, like due to your outstanding videos, we decided to buy you a house. Like that's so funny. Basically, for the rest of the video. Tour of the house and you know blah 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 whatever. Okay, so that was that was it for that video. That video was really horrible. Anyway, guys, um, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And so now you know what what kind of YouTuber Shackle is. He's basically a clickbaiter and like he's kind of like a Mr. Top Five wannabe and he fakes videos. But anyway, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Um, yeah. So he literally pretended that Epic Games bought him a house, which we know that he bought the house himself. Like, it's not like Epic Games bought him a house. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like, sit, like subscribe, and turn on those notifications. So that way you will never miss another one of these videos. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, keep on gaming, guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.